Welcome back to Cabino Games and it's time for your weekly dose of our Guardian 3 Siege Battles. Today we are battling Saigon FC, Fear Club, and we're coming from MY Frenzy. Alright, let's go check out their defenses. We got here a tower of Tien Langs with a mix of Molly, Leona, and that's a Zeratu. Okay, we got here again Tian Lang with more LNDs all about. Wait, what? They got more Tian Langs here? Dude. <laughs> Did we miss a Tian Lang SD or something? I mean, how many Tian Langs do you guys have, Beer Club? And we got here Harmonia with Orion, and that's a Tower of Kinky. Man, so many LNDs. So OP, huh? Okay, well, a Tower of Kano and Chillin over here. Well, let's go straight to the action. Going strong and hitting this Tien Lang Ziratu with a Molly. We're going to bring in our Bulwark Emilia. And our vampire Skogul. Kill Ziratu first. Let's go. Oh man, I mean, let's see. That's a very fast Tien Lang. Let's go transform and buff up. I'm not sure if this Ziratu is gonna cut in, but just in case. Okay, yeah, he does. Alright, so we're gonna go for Pyrian Galder and then Reckless Assault, snipe that Zeratu off the bat. Now the tricky part here is of course the Tien Lang now. Uh, we'll need to survive them until the Molong gets more health from another Forbidden Galder. So that that's, you know, we're talking how many more turns. But we do have a Vampire Molong and we do have him with additional damage based on his max HP on his artifacts here so he will be leeching a little bit of health okay that's a really good stun on the Tian Lang um, man wow look at the heals coming from this Molly though because again the Tian Lang does have a HP lead of 44% right and Molly does heal based on her max HP on her skill 3 so oh no here comes the damage but we do have our Forbidden Galder. Okay. Let's see the Smolly heal again. Okay. Will we survive this? I think we can. Wow, 2000 per hit. Let's go. I'm not gonna go for the Reckless, because if we Reckless Assault, our HP is gonna be low, and that Molly might be able to kill our Molong. And, you know, we wouldn't want that because we can't beat Molly with a Bulwark and an Emilia. So, we're gonna have to wait this through. Wait for another Forbidden Galder right about now. Purifying Wave. Okay, Forbidden Galder. Onto Molly, I think. Oh no, but Molly's gonna take the turn though. Let's see, she's gonna heal herself. Oh, a violent proc automatically heals herself. <laughs> I mean, oh man, this combo. Yeah, we did make a video on this defense a couple of weeks ago, or maybe like last month. Uh, but, ooh. Okay, let's go for the Tian Lang now. All right. I believe we are Gucci. Now we got time for some shoutouts while we're killing this Molly here. Shout out to Ombing, Baron Von Klemz, Kirko Jaranilia, Sashi, Nicolas Gonzalez Maya, Kijamin, Wayu Aditya. We got Todd B, Ren Adriano. Thank you for the comments on the previous video. How do you find the patch, by the way? What monster do you want to see in our upcoming video we are building the barbarians of course 
you will see more action from our pioneers in this siege battle and at the same time we'll try out a few new combos that we can share with you all right now there goes the molly and let's go g g g g g g unit oh man let's try this one out a tianlang leona and a molly okay let's bring in our feng yen together with the emilia and i'm thinking Either Tissarion or Perna. Let's go Tissarion. Or maybe even Laika. But let's try Tissarion because this team is just, you know, uh, what do you call it? Passive heavy. So first to kill, I'm thinking, would be this Tianlang. We'll need Defense Break and Oblivion on the Tianlang so that we can snipe it with our... Fong Yen. Ooh, but the defense break. Oh no, the violent turn. Oh no, not good. Dude, how many turns? Okay. And the... Oh man, there she has the shield. And he stuns too. Okay, but... Is the Fong Yen in trouble here? Wow. Dude, I mean, a violent Tian Lang. Normally, Tian Langs are on in despair, right? But I guess nowadays everyone is on violent. Like, even that Molly is on violent, right? He, she did take how many turns in the beginning of the battle? Oh, man. Can we survive here, though? Come on, Oblivion. Resisted. Ooh, but when she has that shield, right? Okay, we need to buff up our Sarian here. Oblivion. Oh, man. Yeah. Ugh. Ah, we can't. Wow, so much damage, dude. Ooh. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Alright, okay. anyway. Hitting on to Kano, Chilin, and Triana. Let's test this out. We got a Skogul, Basalt, and Copper. Ideally, you'd bring like a wheel, full wheel team, especially on the Skogul, because you know that uh, Karkano can go crazy. Um, so we're gonna go Polar Roar. Polar Roar. <laughs> okay, we're gonna snipe this Triana. Okay. And then hopefully. Ooh, wow. Snipes that. Snipes the copper. Um, also, ideally, Vampire Will on your Skogul, but we do have a violent. Uh, violent Skogul here, right? Um, I don't, I believe this is a violent destroy Skogul. Okay, but there you go, Gucci. We got a tower with Lucas and Orion. I'm thinking, let's play around with our bombers. Okay, together with Aquila. So we got Will on Malaka and Sian. The buffed Aquila. Will it work? Let's see. We do have a full shield will team. No. Oh no. Okay. Two bombs, please. We need two bombs on everyone. Accuracy lead. Water accuracy lead from our Malacca. Two bombs should be good. Oh, come on. Mrs. the Kumun. Oh no. <laughs> Kumun against Ian. Oh no, Valen Prof. Ooh, it too. Did he just take. Oh no. We need to survive this. No. <laughs> right, more Tian Lang, baby. <laughs> 
Tian Lang, Moli, Moli, Molong, and Molly. Let's bring in our Molong again. The second Molong, okay, with this time Nigong and Triana. Okay, let's bring our very own uh, light and dark monster. Okay, is uh, Harmonia, Harmonia. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go pandas. Goes for the harmonia. Uh, huh. I don't want to go for the reckless assault yet. Let's go for the stuns. Okay. Mm, let's heal up our harmonia. Cause yeah, we you should have we should have gone like unwanted harmony there, but. Looking at the attack bars, the Molly is just gonna take the turn and heal somebody, right? But with the lower health on the Molong, let's just heal up, I think. Heal up would be the safest way. Hmm, will this kill this Molly? Okay, nice Violent proc. Let's go for the Reckless. Okay. Now we got Heavenly Protection. And then now we go for Unwanted Harmony because they don't have heals anymore. Ooh. Okay, I think we're pretty good here. Oh man, but you, know, you have to be careful with the Molly nowadays, right? I mean, at least they don't have heals anymore. But. If we went for, say, Unwanted Harmony there, it would have been dangerous, but this is a very safe team. Prone to procs? Of course. I mean, nowadays, you can't beat procs. Well, you can never beat procs anyway, but man, that's such a crazy defense. Last one standing from Mr. Sue. Okay, onwards to the next tower. Okay, this time it's a Molong together with Wusa and Perna. Well, this defense is a bit tricky. But, yeah, let's try this one. A Ladriel with a Diana and a Wusa. Right. Even if, say, they snipe one, we can revive them with our Eladriel. Let's go. The idea behind this is Wusa is going to provide us with the shields, right? And then even if they mow long reckless assaults, Ooh. yeah, let's go work on the mow long, of course. Heal up our Wusa here and continue working on that mow long. Yeah, because the Perna can go for like Eladriel or say the Diana, but. Wow, three turns on that angry Perna. Was that three turns or did... Yeah, I think that was three turns. No more turns for you. <laughs> she just got... You know, she was... Oh no. Uh, let's heal up our Eladriel. Oh no, but then now he shifted to the, uh, the Diana. We gotta snipe this Molong, right? Come on. A little more. Can okay, we get a violent? No violent proc. Okay, nice kill from the Eladriel. 3 versus 2 now. Okay, let's go put on our shields. Start working on this Wusa. Looking at the attack bars, it's pretty safe to transform, right? Okay. Mm, no need to heal nobody. We do have shields. Again, wow. This Perna though. Stuns and stuns and... Uh, let's heal up a little bit. And continue working on this Wusa. I don't think they can come back here. I mean... 
you did see the okay nice it's the diana train can we get the train going ladies and gentlemen can we get another one after this Ooh, no more yeah because this perna though as long as we bring down uh this Wusa it should be good because at the end of the day we do have a Wusa to battle that Perna although the pioneers were nerfed right but still I mean if you can build them on a high HP base you know HP build it the the uh, S2 the mountains power still does do a lot of damage so it's pretty good still pretty good for our uh, pioneers not as strong though but yeah mountains power C 9000 still good I mean it heals too and we, we don't even have an HP lead on the Wusa right because the HP lead is mostly for Eladriel and the Diana um, let's keep working on this Perna just I guess the tricky part here is for her if she's gonna be broken violent going crazy and losing her cooldowns but yeah eternity passive i think how many turns on the burn i think like nine right or ten but she does heal herself now so that's just that's the tricky part okay Oh man, pretty good. I mean, what other teams can you bring against this? Well, you can also bring like um, an Elsharian, right? Elsharian, a wind tank, and someone to tank the Molong and provide some heals as well. Next up, we got here one defense left from Beer Club. It's a, that Harmonia, Orion, and the uh, Kinky, right? Let's bring our Kumun together with our Elusa. Okay, and Lauren. Let's CC this team. And hopefully we have enough damage to kill them. Let's go. It's going to be... Okay, we, well, we're, we're taking the first turn. Let's CC this Harmonia first so that she isn't able to heal, right? We should reduce her attack bars or the Orion. I'm not sure if we're gonna get the other turn. I was hoping the Orion moved first. So let's sleep that Orion. Oh, well, of course. <laughs> I totally thought he was gonna move before the Harmonia did. Oh no. Uh, we gotta reduce attack bars on the Harmonia and strip that immunity so that we get a defense break. And then let's slow her down, right? Okay, nice one, Lauren. Let's go heal the Lauren. A violent Kinky as well. A violent Orion as well. <laughs> okay, let's go work on this Harmonia. Soul Devour. Ooh, we gotta freeze. But the question is, freeze who? I think we should freeze this Orion because we do have slow on the Harmonia. Okay, reduce attack bars. Nice. Nice Valent proc. Um, let's slow down this Orion. Okay. We need to sleep this Harmonia because she still has that unwanted harmony right okay please sleep okay nice too Ooh, violent kinky okay let's go for the kill come on okay oh no oh so close work on this orion now heal up sleep okay nice sleep on that kinky okay but then 
the tricky part here is of course ha getting to CC this kinky here. Um, okay, let's go. Ooh, nice heal block. We need to freeze. Okay. Oh man. Uh, sleep or freeze? I think heal first. Reduce attack bars. But he keeps revenging though. Not good. A violent destroy Kinky. Well, at least we do have him on a heal block. Okay. Oh, finally the freeze and the CC. Oh man, I mean, but Kinkies are just so scary, right? All right, we got Carcano with Praha, and that's a Taranis. Let's bring in our Luis together with Agani and the Rika. Time to play around with some dots, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully we don't get out proct, but let's go. Who's gonna move first, the Praha? Uh, reset the Praha. Oh no. Here we go. Okay, good thing that Taranis did the damage not on the Gani but on the uh, Luis, right? Now we reset this Taranis. No more revives for you, my friend. And start working on this Praha. We don't need to stun. Okay, now we go for the stun when our Rika gets her turn. Okay, Toy Knight. Nice stuns. Time to ventilate onto the Rika so we have more dots. Okay. Repeat Gucci. Oh, but. Yeah, I mean. Every time we get Violent procs, it's just. It's, of course it's good, but it only means that a few turns later, it's going to be the defense who's going to be going crazy. Oh man. Just so one-sided this RNG sometimes. Down to our last attacks. We gotta hit this Tianlang, dude. Hmm, more Tianlangs. Let's go for Kyo. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but we don't have the Molong anymore though. I wanted to go like a Molong, um, Arnold and Molly. But unfortunately, we don't have Emilio anymore. Um, how about, let's play around with Chasun, Ciara and Molly. Yeah, I don't know. Um... I'm hoping that the Leona will focus on the Molly, right? But we don't... I'm thinking Fran. But then the Chaston with the HP lead is good and she has been buffed. This is Levin on a prayer. <laughs> okay, first to kill would be the Tianlang, of course. Oh, but yeah, the Sierra's faster than the Chasun, though. The Molly is gonna cleanse that. Um. Okay, we need to bomb the Tianlang, but again, this Sierra does have a high crit rate, so every time she crits, she gives at more attack bars. To this Tian Lang, right? And then at the same time. Oh, come on. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh man. The Tian Lang wakes up out of stun. Of course. <laughs> Puts a defense break on the Ciara. And then, of course, two hits from the Leona just finishes it. I mean, I don't think we can come back from this. I mean, we don't have enough damage. We can survive it, but... I don't know. Damn, dude. Okay, uh... We gotta hit it again. We've lost 
two times already. Let's bring in our Zingze Laika and Riley. We'll need the defense break. We won't glance because we do have the Laika, right? But the question is, will Riley be able to provide us with enough sustain and heals? Let's see. Okay. Tian Lang. Okay. Wow, the damage coming from this Leona though. Defense break. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to kill the this Leona because she's just so crazy, man. Ugh. I think we should have gone for the Tian Lang there. Um we don't have cleanse anymore. Oh man. I think that's a dead Zing Z, is it? Well anyway, let's go heal up. Oh Yeah, that's a dead Zing Z. Damn. So much damage. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, time to summon ourselves at the end lang, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I, mean, <laughs> I think you have to have a Tien Lang in order to join beer club or something, no? <laughs> and that's the last of our monster attacks for today. 61 wins is to 94 losses on this defense. Okay, time to wait for the results of this crazy siege battle. That's a GG well played to Saigon FC and Beer Club. That's, I don't know, one crazy defense with a Tian Lang. And of course the Leona is good too, for sure. Time for our Triple S Trophy Box. Can we get ourselves a Light and Dark Scroll with a Tian Lang in it? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Okay, not too shabby. Thank you for the light and dark pieces. And thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like if you did. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you haven't to our channel for more content. Happy Chinese New Year ahead. Kung Hei Fat Chai. And may the force be with you. We'll see you on the next one.